MotorWeek is made possible by Cars.com. Your host for MotorWeek, John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to MotorWeek. We're glad to have you with us. By most estimates, one of the fastest growing automotive segments for the near future will be compact luxury utilities. Despite rough times and unstable fuel prices, it's felt that premium buyers would rather downsize their posh utes than give them up. It's a field that is growing more crowded every day, with the latest addition, this Mercedes-Benz GLK 350. So let's see if the best known name in luxury motoring got it right. Mercedes-Benz already had one of the broadest lineups of luxury utilities on the market, but their portfolio was not complete before the arrival of the 2010 GLK 350. This is the brand's first compact crossover utility destined to compete directly with the BMW X3, Audi A5, and Acura RDX. Size-wise, the five-passenger GLK slides neatly under the M-Class. It's about 10 inches shorter in overall length at 178.3, with just over six inches less wheelbase at 108.5. But in terms of style, it veers away from the M. The boxy GLK class blends chiseled lines with sculpted surfaces to achieve an edgier interpretation of the rough and tumble G-Wagons of yore. The front end with its oversized grille and expressive headlamps is especially reminiscent of the classic G-Class. But the GLK's taut seamless profile is then punctuated by a modern steeply raked windshield and a bold rising character line. It then gains an extra shot of height thanks to standard roof rails, plus a dash of sportiness with 19-inch 10-spoke alloys, with 20 inches optional. But the sawed-off back end emphasizes the real goal of lots of volume in a small box, albeit decorated with chrome exhaust tips and a roof spoiler. For power, the GLK350 uses the same variable timing 3.5-liter V6 engine found in the ML350. Output is 268 horsepower and 258 pound-feet of torque. With 700 pounds less to move around, the 3.5 provides the GLK with more than ample power. Zero to 60 takes only 6.5 seconds. Its very torquey response reminds us more of a turbo diesel. That torque moves through a gear-skipping seven-speed automatic transmission with manual mode and onto our tester's full-time 4MATIC all-wheel drive system. A rear-wheel drive only GLK is now also available. But even though the GLK is the most fuel-efficient Mercedes-Benz gas utility ever, its government fuel economy ratings are nothing to crow about. 16 city, 21 highway on premium. We manage 20 miles per gallon in real-world driving. Sharing much of its mechanicals with the agile C-Class, our GLK 350-4MATIC rides on a lightweight McPherson strut front suspension with a rear multi-link geometry. One novel turn is the agility control damping system. Each shock absorber has a bypass piston that dampens road noise and vibration like a very soft shock, but at the same time preserves the handling response of stiffer shocks. Indeed, in corners, our GLK 354 Matic proves to be an impressively precise and nimble handler. It remains tight and sharp through higher speed cornering, but exhibits a light, easy feel at parking lot speeds. Body roll is minimal, delivering an overall solid and extremely well-planted performance. The thin snow of late winter was no big deal for the 4MATIC AWD system, but it worked flawlessly and provided us with extra confidence when it counted. Electronic stability and traction control also helped the cause. The GLK stopping power comes from four-wheel vented disc brakes with ABS and brake assist. Hard stops were always straight, but the feel is a little grabby with an almost on-off jerkiness. It takes some getting used to. The GLK interior is a case of making the most of limited space. Inside, designers have crammed seating for five adults and almost every conceivable feature a Mercedes buyer could wish for. Fit and finish are high quality, not overly luxurious, but certainly fitting, with gauges and controls that are smart and sophisticated. 
Front seats are well padded, equipped with eight-way power, plus optional heat and position memory. Notable standards include a tilt telescoping steering wheel with satellite controls, Bluetooth, and dual zone automatic climate. For safety, expect nothing less than six airbags plus active front head restraints. A standard panorama sunroof affords occupants their daily dose of vitamin D, while a pricey multimedia package adds command control with navigation, Harman Kardon surround sound, and a rear view camera, all must haves for the techno elite. The rear confines offer plenty of head and leg room for full six footers. The split bench folds to expand storage space to a max of 54.7 cubic feet. The load floor is wider than the M-Class and includes a concealed bin. The premium package adds the convenience of a 115 volt outlet and power lift gate. Pricing for the GLK350 4MATIC starts at $36,775. You can knock two grand off for rear wheel drive. Our very well equipped formatic stickered at $44,965. The 2010 GLK350 shows that Mercedes Benz indeed has foresight. This downsized, right sized luxury utility was launched just as overweight, conspicuous consumption fell out of fashion. Plus, while a smaller package, it's attractive, well powered, and leaves nothing to want. It's the multi purpose Mercedes Benz for a new era and we liked it a lot.